Greetings, my friends, and welcome to Trizity Traveling. I'm your host, John, and today's trip report is a visit to Portage Glacier outside of Anchorage, Alaska. I had seen Portage Glacier on my flight scene tour the day before, and we had visited the Alaska Wildlife Conservation Center and decided, hey, let's go check out that glacier boat tour thing. Seeing the glacier from the air, you know, it looked big, but, you know, meh, big, meh, everything in Alaska is big. Well, when you get on the water and you're face to face with the glacier, it is immense. I was uh, really surprised at how impressed I was by the sheer size of the glacier face entering the lake. I think I captured that in the trip report here, and so I hope you enjoy what follows. But before we get to the trip report, please take a second to click the subscribe button, mash the reminder bell, and you'll be notified of future trips. All right, let's go ahead and get to that glacier boat tour. Way over there is the cruise boat approaching the glacier. Again, lots of wind. I don't know if you can hear a word I'm saying, but that's the boat we're going to be on here in about 35 minutes. As I mentioned in the intro, everything in Alaska is just so big. I hope I capture for you the immensity of Alaska, just a little bit of it on this video. No masks when you're sitting outside. And on the trip over to the glacier, we're looking for doll sheep on the sides of these mountains. My guide says there's a doll sheep in that shot. I never really could see it, but I don't have an eye for wildlife. Multiple waterfalls entering the lake. It's easy to be distracted and forget that you're there for the glacier. Looking the other way for sheep and turned around and saw this. We're getting a lot, a lot closer though. The scenery is just breathtaking. And when you actually get to the glacier face, it is so much larger than I thought it was from the air. one of the many beautiful waterfalls. We hung out at the glacier face, hoping for some calving. No calving occurred while we were there, but there's clear evidence of calving all over the lake with all the little pieces of ice. Turns out this is one of my favorite things and I'm really grateful that I had a chance to visit the glacier. There may come a day it won't be there anymore. Here's some final views of the Portage Glacier area. Simply breathtaking landscapes. If you have any questions or comments about visiting Portage Glacier or the boat tour on Portage Lake, please post those below. I'm always happy to respond. And as we pull into our berth, I want to wish you and yours safe and happy travels.